Okay. <sighs> All right, I guess it is off to Ancestral Mound might be easiest to approach if I if I come at it from um, the City of Tears one. Uh, that shouldn't be too difficult as long as I'm careful. Uh, I think I think I think that could that one would work. Crossroads. Um, right. uh, I think if I go to the deep nest one, though, um, I think if I go to so the, the thing about the, the the deep nest one is that I have two to choose from. So even if I screw it up, I can probably recover by going to the next one. So I'm not too worried uh, about that as kind of a backup option. I mean, I'm extremely annoyed that I have to do it, but I, well, I don't really have a choice, do I? Okay. To the right, and then down a whole bunch, and then down a whole bunch, and then <laughs> let's go for it. <sighs> that hurt. That hurt the soul. That hurt the Isla Mau so much to to get to get walloped by that one guy. I even was downward striking. I was. Down, I was down attacking, and it it didn't. It, I did it too late or too early or something, but it didn't work. And and he snuck in that one hit on me. Oh, it was really the freaking the uh, the fart cloud. The fart cloud, though, that was the one. That was the one that made this so much worse. Uh, if I didn't have to fart constantly, then life would be so much better. The fart cloud triggered triggered that one jelly, and and that that was what really that was what did it, man. That was what did it. I'm not looking forward to this. I'm not looking forward to having to do this having to do this the hard way, like going through this area. And I don't have a map either. That's even better, isn't it? Okay, 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 okay. Good, good. Really, really nice camera angle there. Really, really not filling me with a whole lot of fear to just have to be forced to do this crazy free fall or anything like that. Fuck me. Fuck me. Okay. Okay, I'm weirdly safe right here. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's ruined. Oh, it's ruined. I forgot that the fucking enemies come out of the ground in this hellhole. Okay, so that, I'm down two, which means that um, technically this still could work. I just need to be... Um, okay, now I'm down three. Okay, so now I need... Now it's not... Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. It's ruined. Okay. I'm, uh... I'm, I'm, I'm bailing. I'm bailing on this one. Uh... We're going back to... We're gonna... We're gonna have to start over. We're gonna have to retry it. There's no way. There's no way now. Yep. Shit. Ah... Ah, uh, I know that the meme is two try bird, but like, I didn't, 
I didn't want this one to be two tries. I was doing so good. I was doing so good. I even had the right reaction time on everything. Uh, I'm gonna check the charm sales lady too. Maybe maybe she has a charm that'll uh, give me more Isle of Mal or something. I really enjoy it. I'm assuming that the reward for it probably isn't going to be that great because, I mean, why why would it be? But at the same time, I'm enjoying it. I think that it's just a lot of, I think it's a fun challenge. I think that it's a good excuse to use a, uh, a kind of interesting charm. I like the, I, I, I don't know, I like it. I like that it's, um, uh... Uh, where the hell am I now? I'm trying to make my way to the Mantis Village, but I don't even have that. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I didn't make it to the Mantis Village. Okay. Okay. Let's try... I don't think I have enough money to afford uh, the charms that are necessary here. But, um, I mean, I do, sorry, I guess what I'm saying is, I don't think I have the money to buy any more charms. Oops. Um, but it, uh, just in case, I mean, I could try to figure something out. I could go to the guy in the thing that, uh, buys my shit to, uh, get my money refilled real quick. I mean, I did get the really cool item that... Um, it's the first one I've gotten the entire game, so he probably would like that one quite a lot. So I'm sure that I can probably get enough money real quick to to buy out the uh, the the charm lady. So let's try that. Ooh, no, thank you. Okay, is this where I need to be going? Having to navigate without the uh, icon on the map is actually not difficult whatsoever, but it's slightly more effort than I really was intending to put in here, so I consider it a remarkable inconvenience. This is not the right way. I think. This doesn't feel like the right way. Yeah, this isn't the right way. Oh, man. I can't believe... I can't believe how close I got. Can't believe that. You know how I was saying earlier that the epitaph would, uh, the most embarrassing epitaph would be, you died by asphyxiation from, uh, from your, um, fr from getting farted to death. I think that there's one thing that's even more embarrassing than that. And that is, uh, dying from, or getting cucked by your own farts. That's what happened to me today. That's what's happening, that's what's happening to me today. We were compass, gathering swarm, and... Oh, I didn't realize that the fragile greed, uh, still intact. I guess I should have been equipping that guy. Is there anything else that seems good? I feel like there's one more thing I'm missing that I usually like to go for. Oh, it's the heal up thing. But it's fine. We'll see the Grim's Child just because it's a decent enough charm. Um, how to get to that lady quickly? How to get to her quickly? Charm lady, charm lady. Where is she on the map again? Uh, Blue Lake. I think I'm gonna go blue to Blue Lake too. Okay, so Forgotten Crossroads, and then we'll take a quick pit stop over in, um, over in the, uh, Blue Lake as well, because I want to see what, uh, see what, see what happens there, see what I'm missing there still. I hate how difficult the Forgotten Crossroads are to navigate at this point. I get that that's the point, though, but, like... I could still hate it just because that's the purpose. Uh, okay, we're fine. We're fine. So sit. 
The problem that I have with the Forgotten Crossroads is that I, um, I keep not knowing, like, which paths are blocked off and stuff like that, which that's kind of what really creates issues for me. Navigating around here is a pain. Alright, 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 alright. Here we go. Hello, lady. Okay. This charm seeps life, blood, and will certainly improve your constitution. Hmm. Only your enemies will be within reach. Uh, stay firmly in place while we'll swinging your little nail around. Shaman stone. Make spells stronger. Even. Helps you focus faster. Ooh, there's a lot of good stuff here. We'll take the we'll take the lifeblood heart. That's an easy one. That'll help me immediately with my quest. This one I kind of like. I really I'm I'm liking this one that makes me focus faster because that'll synergize really well with the um with the thing that makes me uh, heal more, but it takes longer for the focus to work. That could be very cool. It's probably worth just buying, because uh, I have the money. The other one that seems pretty interesting is the thing that makes my nail longer. Long nail, yeah. This one seems kind of interesting, because uh, I think that it might stack with the other thing that makes my nail longer. I think that if I get both of those, um, I will have a pretty easy time. Oh, wow, that was a long range on that thing. Uh, I think if I get both of those, I could probably have like a really, really long reaching attack. <laughs> Could be interesting stuff. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, anyway, I'm lost. I think that to get to the, I'm trying to find my way to the stag thing, which I guess is up to the, le where, where am I here? Um, this blue lake seems very tempting. Okay, anyway. Um, let's, uh, let's head over to the stag beetle thing. We'll equip my stuff. And then, uh, the nice thing is... That'll put me at, like, 14. So I believe that I won't need to do, uh, Pog Canyon. Uh, to do the... To do that quest. I think I, I'll be able to just do the, the... The one from the start of the game and the one from the Mantis Village. To, uh, complete... Or to have enough health to do the Joni's Blessing thing in the jig. Ow. Okay, please don't die, bird. Good. Very good. Wang and... Oh, he's already here. Okay, so since I've done this, we're... We're ready to go. Let's go to the bench. Let's take off the... The fart cloud. Let's take off the... Grim's child, probably. And take off the fragile greed. We will re-equip Joni's blessing. We will re-equip the lifeblood heart. Okay, what else can I get rid of? Uh, gathering swarm. We can get rid of gathering swarm. We'll equip the lifeblood heart. And this gets to be pretty dang close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Alright. The dirt mouth. First. Then Mantis Village. And then that'll put me at... Uh, that, that ought to do it, right? Maybe. Hang on. I did... How many did I do last time? I think I just did that one. And that one. And that's all I needed to do. Wait. No, no. I also did... No? Okay. Let's just see. Let's just count it out. So, I don't remember how many I'm actually going for. That's the other thing. Um, it could be... Uh, it could be that I need... Uh, all I remember is that I needed five more than 12. So, 
That might not be true. <laughs> That's just what I remember. Whack, whack. One, two. Okay, so I have that. Next we do the Mantis Village. And that should be enough. Yeah, doing doing that in the Mantis Village should be should be should be enough. Okay. Could be simpler. There's something falling across my screen and it really weirded me out. It was a little particle effect, but I didn't like it. <laughs> okay. This very, very nervous. Not really. I'm slightly very nervous. Queen Station. It's just a whoopies. It's just it's just a whoopers. I don't need to worry. I don't need to panic. We should be fine. I really wish that I had written down how many I need. I'm assuming that I that I that I count that I mem I remembered it remembered it correctly. I No. Okay. Okay, that that might that might require uh Okay, it's 15. Okay. So I have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13. Is that 13? So if I do then if I do the Mantis Village, that puts me at 15. And that should be enough. Okay. Okay. Whack. Alright. The other thing is that like I've been playing for almost two hours at this point. And um, my focus is starting to give out a little bit. I haven't been playing for two hours, um, only an hour and a half. But like, this is fairly demanding of my concentration. And I'm hoping that I will be able to focus up enough to at least get through this part. Okay, how many do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Alrighty. Alrighty. God, it'd be really devastating to me if it turns out that the mantis is still, uh, could still hurt you on um just by touching them and i accidentally were to, uh touch them that would be that would be uh pretty tragic shakespeare himself would would look at that situation and be like oh bruh i feel bad for you off if I also uh, make it to the abyss. The abyss, the enemies in the abyss are pretty, oh, very close that one. Um, they're pretty easy to dodge. All they do is hang out on the walls, so all I need to do is avoid going on the walls. Just kind of jump it. I should be okay. taking no chances taking none none right now I know I don't even need to fight that guy he's nice and out of the way I don't care I'm still gonna hit him with the with the with the Isle of Mao cannon I don't want this to be another situation of oh, trying so hard and getting so far 
I may also just like not even commentate for a little while, depending on like how how nervous I end up getting as we get close to the abyss. I don't know. Let's use the bench and get ready. Tear Okay. It is Palace Grounds. Why didn't I see it there? Where is it? I guess it might be called Hidden Station? But I thought Hidden Station was the Stag Nest. But I guess the Stag Nest was probably called Stag Nest. Okay. Summon all of that gamer juice. Spirit of the Isle of Maus, uh, invigorate my soul. I know there's no enemies down there, but I need to I need to know, no, you know. Okay. We do lots of looking down. We avoid walls. And we take this real, real careful and controlled. Everything here is spiky and wants to hurt me. But I made it. Aw. Kind of really pretty. You know it would be so messed up if I also needed to make it through here without taking any damage. I'm operating in the assumption that that is true. So I'm going to be taking this also really carefully. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Did I not take any damage? Or do I just have a lot more Isla Mal hearts or, or Soggy Boys than I know how to count? I, maybe I don't. Do I not take damage in this area? Maybe. Yeah, I, I don't know. Okay, that's lifeblood core. Was that it? I can't enter here. I barely explored that. Is there anything else there? Hmm. When resting, the bearer will gain a coating of lifeblood that protects them from a large amount of damage. Uh, there was an ancient egg that you missed. Uh, you mean the, the rancid eggs? Or arcane eggs, maybe? Okay. I don't really care then. Little vendor trinket. Okay, that's fine. That's not a big deal. Alrighty. Well, that's it for me. What an excellent, excellently fun uh, way to way to end this one. That was pretty swag. 
Oh. Wow, wasn't that amazing? Like, comment, and subscribe. It really is the best way to support the channel, and it'll give me encouragement to keep on going with this stuff. So, uh, I'd really appreciate it, and, you know, thanks for watching.